This is the Caplio R1, the Ricoh camera you've probably never heard of. The Ricoh Caplio R1 was introduced in 2004 and features a CCD sensor with a whopping 4 megapixels. This was once the fastest digicam in the world, ready to shoot in under 1 second after you turn it on. This was the first camera of Ricoh's Caplio R series and it features a zoom lens that ranges from 28mm to 135mm in full frame terms. Nine, YouTube. Off YouTube? Yeah. Da habe ich gerade gedacht, warum nicht, wenn das Wetter gut ist, jetzt gehe ich eh raus mit dir. Jetzt wenn er, lauf mal da vorbei einfach. Now before I tell you why I shoot on this camera in 2023, let me just quickly go over some of the specs. Probably the most important feature of the Ricoh Caplio R1 is the exposure compensation. It ranges from minus two to plus two stops and I would recommend to shoot the camera in minus 0.3 to minus 0.7 stops, especially when shooting in harsh sunlight because there is just not a lot of dynamic range. Underexposing the camera kind of gives you that desired look that the camera produces. The camera has an ISO range from 64 to 800 and it also has a macro mode. It also allows you to shoot video and it even has a mode to take voice recording. The Caplio R1 has a terrible TFT monitor but has a viewfinder which kind of compensates for that but it is tiny. Other than that the camera runs on two AA batteries and regular SD cards. Coffee photography. <laughs> So. Now why am I shooting a 19 year old digital camera in 2023? because it is a lot of fun. I love the color signs of this camera, especially when you shoot it underexposed. I typically underexpose by 0.3 to 0.7 stops, which tends to give me the best results considering the camera's low dynamic range. I like how the camera has a little bit of a cinematic vibe to it. I kind of like how it tends towards green a little bit. And to me, and I know this is a stretch, but I think it is kind of a better version of Fujifilm's classic Chrome. One of my least favorite steps is actually editing photos and I don't have to do much with the photos that come out of the Caplio R1. All I typically do when editing the photos in Lightroom is play with the exposure and contrast. And that is pretty much it. I just love the look straight out of camera and the very distinct look the camera produces. To sum it up in one sentence, the Ricoh Caplio R1 has character. It is always kind of surprising to see what a camera that old can actually do. If you, your parents or your friends have an old Digicam around, don't get rid of it. Take your time and take it out for a spin. If you want to see more photos from the Ricoh Caplio R1 and a few other Digicams, make sure to watch this video on the end screen. That is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.